Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for joining me this week. So I'm going to be showing another beautiful functionality in terms of Padlet and how we can get lots of different lesson ideas for different grade groups. So if you're interested in finding out how can we get lots of different lesson ideas for different grade levels, then please keep on watching. Okay, so this week I was actually working with a wonderful early years team. There were about a hundred wonderful humans and we were exploring different mathematical concepts. I wanted them to explore the power of AI on Padlet. And so let me just move myself out of the way and let's actually do it. So um, I showed all the AI recipes on Padlet and I want to stress I'm not sponsored by Padlet, but it is a really wonderful tool. And if we just come down here for ideas for classroom activities, we're going to press on that and then I need to move myself out of the way. I'm going to say math, kindergarten, and then let's look at one-to-one -one correspondence because that is a really important concept in uh, early years mathematics. And let's say we want that to do with counting and also maybe some addition because I've worked with some beautiful early learners who are actually capable of doing some addition problems. Um, so the classroom resources here is optional. The addition details are optional. I'm just gonna create now. So this is for kindergarten and it takes a little while for the magic to happen. When I was exploring this with a hundred early years teachers, you should have heard, you should have heard the wow that came up. So look at all of these ideas and it's still adding to the walls. And I can say, do I like the AI generated board or not? So we can do counting with music. There's a little YouTube video and it gives you the actual link and it gives you the actual explanation. So play a simple children's song or rhyme that involves counting. Let the students move and count along with the rhyme. This reinforces counting in a fun way, an energetic way. Um, what else do we have? Addition with beads. Oh, okay. So provide beads and string for students so that they can create necklaces or we can use magnetic tiles or any kind of materials that link together. So it doesn't just have to be beads or string. Start with a few and keep adding, asking them to count the total number of beads each time. We could also explore the concept of patterns using that activity. And then what else do we have? We've got um, addition with classroom objects. So use classroom objects like pencils or crayons, have students group them into small sets and then combine them to practice addition and encourage them to count out loud. I mean, look at all these ideas. This literally took five seconds to create. We can keep generating different walls, which has got great classroom activities for students. And we can also add to this wall as well. So I think that AI is so powerful for us to get these wonderful lesson ideas for students of all ages. And I've just noticed one down here, number line hopscotch. That is an absolutely fantastic example of counting and using a number line because not only is it kinesthetic, students are moving and it requires balance at the same time as them practicing their counting and even some simple addition problems by adding their hops. So once again, thank you Padlet. I hope that you found this useful. You can generate ideas for any grade level, but I wanted to specifically show you how to generate ideas for kindergarten because I had such a wonderful time last week with these wonderful early years teachers. If you have any questions, please feel free to put it in the comment section below. And thank you for joining me once again, and I hope to see you next time.